It's probably the strangest cafe you'll ever log on to. And it gives a whole new meaning to the word bite. Sandwiched in between the cappuccino machine and the chocolate chip cookies is a cluster of computers connected to the World Wide Web. The Big Surf Cyber Cafe in Detroit's swank suburb of Birmingham was the brainchild of Bob Pulte. The successful home builder had been wanting to open a coffee shop, but he was looking for something different. So this buddy of mine, Dan Barron, who is a uh, computer wizard, uh, we commonly call him our geek, uh, he came up with this catch that uh, in order to draw people to the coffee shop, we have to give them something that will entice them to come in other than good coffee, and what we wanted to do was this internet stuff. Our linkages that we had... That twist turned out to be the Birmingham Information Group, or BIG. Pulte and his partner Mike Walsh have carved out their own drag strip on the information superhighway. So what is this place? A coffee shop? An office? An art gallery? I guess it's really all those things. Exactly. For example, these paintings on the walls were done by the same artists who created the group's home page. Let's see what's at the art museum. For $10 an hour, customers can roam the freeways and back roads of the World Wide Web. Those who know the ins and outs easily race through cyberspace on high-speed data lines. And for newcomers, there's plenty of help available. But if you want to be more specific than that, when, once the image clicks down, we can click on to the region and get a better uh, understanding of what's going on. Big's full-service marketing company also offers their expertise for businesses to access the world's newest advertising media. Food's good, too. <laughs> Terry Phillips, CBS News, Birmingham, Michigan.